the all-new Megane E-Tech electric crossover is another serious budge up from battery technology as it starts to shove combustion engines out of the mainstream. After all, the Megane is a trusty old member of the family hatchback class, but this new car is purely electric, albeit to be sold alongside the plug-in hybrid Megane for a couple of years. This, in fact, is because this design was originally conceived as the styling for a performance version of the new car. As design boss Lawrence Van Den Acker told us, everyone liked it so much that we made it the standard styling. That will also explain the 20 inches wheels that will be standard fit on higher spec versions, then. This is also an important car for Renault, since it's the first model to sit on its new EV-specific modular platform, the CMF EV. In this guise, that means front-wheel drive and a slimline mattress of lithium-ion batteries with a usable capacity of either 40 kWh or 60 kWh, which translates to a WLTP range of 186 or 292 miles. DC rapid charging can be done at a rate of up to 130 kW on the 60 kWh model, which is good for a 10 to 80% charge in half an hour. Expect the 40 kWh model to have slower charging, the CCS rapid charging plug might even be optional, but every Megane E-Tech Electric will be able to take 22 kW from an AC charger. As for how it drives? Well, Renault banded about the phrase, this is the GTI of the class in its press conference, which Volkswagen might not be too pleased about, nor Renault Sport, we imagine.